Hey guys, so today I have an unboxing for you. This is a new rod. Um, I got it from Midwest Custom Fly Rods. I have not opened this yet. I have not even taken a look at this yet. So, um, we're going to open this together. I am really excited. Bubble wrap. Ooh, I chose the blank and I got it from um, the hook and the hackle. So this is uh, uh, the XI series blank. This is a 10 foot 3 weight. It says right here. Let's see if I can turn this around so you can read it better. XI series 10 foot 3 weight 4 piece. Alright, so um, that's basically the blank is that. It's a nice beautiful green blank. It's like a like a forest green almost like this, the, the color of the sock. But it comes with a nice sock. It's a very high quality blank, and I really like it. Um, I actually have the same one on one of my other rods, the same blank. Um, it's a five weight, um, nine foot five weight. And I custom made that myself, and I just, I, I fell in love with that blank. It's a really good blank. It's got enough flex to keep most fish um, when you're fishing a little larger hook, but it, it, it's also enough, uh, um, you know, backbone to it really get out far. I mean, I can cast a mile, so um, I really wanted it for this uh, Euro nymphing style rod. So let's go ahead and take a look. And you know, these blanks aren't that bad. I think they were like 70 bucks. Good deal. Ooh, uh, I already can tell I like that. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, this is really nice. So I had said in an earlier video I was going to do a brown with like a blue, but um, I talked with him more and more, and he just said that he didn't think that would come out looking very good. And he showed, he did some sample wraps for me, and, and I agreed. But these are beautiful. I ended up getting these titanium. They're a little more expensive, but the titanium guides, which are, are going to last a little longer, they're nice and darker. Um, but the guides are just really nice. Look at it, extra, oversized right here, so that's going to be really good for nymphing. That's such a good job he did. I think he did a great job with that. Really nice. See if I can get that to focus for you. A nice dark brown with a gold wrap on a on a really uh, yeah, forest green color rod blank and I excuse my kid in the background he's out playing out, out in the living room I just I just got this in the mail and I just couldn't wait to look at it and I wanted to do an unboxing video alright so here's the second piece you know just the same beautiful wrap jobs Amazing job. So I was able, because this is custom, he custom makes them for you, you're able to choose, um, you know, I mean, he can he can just, if you just tell him, hey, make me a really pretty rod, he'll do that too. But um, you can choose, you know, what, uh, what colors you want um, for the wrap, you can choose what type of uh, guides you want. Oh, it's really nice too. So here's the start, here's a bigger Obviously, you can see it a little better, a little bigger, one of the, the guides, okay? And then here comes the, the stripping guide. Boy, that's really nice. And now, oh my gosh. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, wow. Alright, so he uh, put a plastic on this just to keep it nice, and I'll take that off in a second. I had this custom uh, wood, burled wood insert. It's green, it matches the color of the rod, and it's just amazing. I've got this titanium uh, reel seat. Take this off. Oh, that's really nice. Super light. Take a look at that burled wood, amazing looking 
burled wood. Oh, I am so happy. This is such a nice rod. Look at that. It is really not doing it justice, but you can see the XI series blank. He turned that around so that way, if you look, it says McFly Angler. He actually was able to put a little sticker insert just for me. I thought that was really cool. And then I've got these little wraps every few uh, two and a half inches. So it starts here. This first one is 15, 17 and a half, uh, 20, uh, 22 and a half, I believe, and then 25. So that way I'm able to measure my fish. So I just basically it starts at the butt and it goes up from there, right? So this will be a 15 inch fish, I know. Boom, from that point to that point. So all I do is make it really simple. I can just strip out a little extra line. I've got my uh, fish in the net. And I can just basically measure it up, boom, just like that, and uh, you know, see how roughly how long it's going to be, which is really nice. No more of the guesswork, you know. But boy, that is that is just perfect. I mean, look, look at the epoxy job on this. Like these small little wraps, it's bubbled just at the wrap, and that's it. You know, I'm mean, not bubbled, but like just epoxy only at that wrap. It's not overdone. It's just really nice. You know, I gotta cut off this, uh, I just want to see the real true beauty of this rod. I'm not going to be like my grandma who keeps the plastic on the, on the, um, on her furniture, you know. Um, one of my, oh man. Oh, that is really nice. Wow, that is just absolutely amazing. Ah, oh, that's perfect. That's the right size for my hand too. And look at how nicely tapered this is on the ends. This is just absolutely one of the nicest rods I think I own. I, I like this, I think, I like this better than my Sage. Did a better job with this than he did with the than than Sage did with their really expensive rod. Now the kicker here, let me just tell you, um, the price of this, the price of this is just so reasonable. He did such an amazing, custom, beautiful, amazing job. Spent hours, hours and hours and hours working with me on, you know, getting the right components and the right um, color and everything and. Um, and this cost me about, after everything was said and done, about 275 bucks. That includes the, the blank, which is about $70. This blank was $70, the XI series blank. You can get it at hookinthehackle.com. Go to www.hook... Excuse my kid in the background there. Yes, buddy. Yes. I'll pop it. Oh, you can pop this, yes. Take it out there and go pop it. Close the door, okay? I love you. Alright, all my kid wanted to do is pop the bubble wrap. <laughs> so, um, this uh, blank you can get at thehookandhackle.com. Uh, sorry, www.hookhack. So, H O O K H A C K, I believe, dot com. Um, so, www.hookhack.com. Check it out there. I'll put a link in the bottom of the video here. Um, just check that out. Um, but this blank was like 70 bucks. Um, he does have some blanks he can get for cheaper. Um, but, you know, I, I'm not saying they're bad. I, don't, I just don't know them. I do know this blank, and I know it to be a quality blank. I really did like um, it, everything about it So um, that I on my other rod. So, um, but I got the blank. That was 70 bucks. So, all in all, I think, dude, I mean, look at this cork job. It's just absolutely amazing, isn't it? It's just such a beautiful custom rod. I think the total would have been like 200 bucks, maybe 220 or something like that. When it, it if I didn't do the special components and and uh, maybe two, I think he said he can go as low as like 180 or something like that, roughly. Don't quote me on any of the prices. I don't make his prices. I don't know 100. Um, percent 
um, you'd have to contact him. Yeah, Midwest Custom Fly Rods, I believe just www.midwestcustomflyrods.com. I think you can check it out there. I think that's his website. But man, he does such an amazing job for so inexpensive. I mean, it's just, it's crazy. This is far and away better than any other rod I own. And to get something like this fully custom made, just beautiful work, a total of 275 roughly, you know, and, and if you want to go more, a little more basic, but one of his, you know, beautiful builds still, amazing jobs um, on all of his rods. Um, I've, I've actually fished with one other one that he did that was more of a simpler one, that 10 foot four weight that uh, my subscriber sent me. And that's how I got to know this company. He sent me one of the rods to use and I asked where he got it built and uh, he told me, so got one myself. That's what this is. So this is going to be my Euro Nymphing rod, and I am just so pleased with this. Beautiful three weight. Um, I'm going to have to fish with this soon. I wanted to show you the reel that I'm putting on this. Okay, this is a that Maverick Qualify Products, that Maverick reel by that guy Joe. This is a nice, beautiful green color, just like the blank. It's it's, I mean, it almost looks like this is made for it. This is going to be my prized possession. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you if you like these unboxing type videos, um, I plan on having more. Um, and I've also got uh, fishing videos. So if you just stumbled across this channel and you've uh, this is the first one, first video you've seen. Um, excuse my boring background here. We just moved into this house, so I don't have all my stuff set up. Usually I've got all my fly tying equipment up on the wall on pegboard. Plan on putting that up soon. Just haven't had the chance of doing it. But um, I do fly tying videos. I do uh, um, actual fishing videos where I go out and fish uh, rivers and, and catch fish on video. So um, just subscribe if you like this uh, if you like fly fishing um, you'll definitely enjoy this channel I believe and um, uh, you know if you're already a subscriber uh, thanks for continue watching um, and uh, I'll let you guys know more about this rod and real setup and how I like it over the t course of time it's beautiful it's really nice it's crisp it's clean um, I just need to get out and do some casting now, so I need to catch a fish on it and see fully how it does. So, And I hope to get out soon. It's just snowing right now. <laughs> I don't want to go out in the snow. So hopefully the weather clears up and allows me to get out there and fish. Um, I know this is not a fishing video, this is an unboxing video. I'm going to see if I have a little time to get out there in the next couple days before Thursday. I'm filming this on Tuesday. and. Um, so I don't have a lot of time to edit. So I need to get this in, edit it, um, see if I can get out there and actually fish. If this weather stops tomorrow, hopefully I can get out there and just do a few clips. I might drop some clips in at the end of this video of some actual fishing stuff. But um, as soon as this uh, weather clears up, I'll be back out there pushing and uh, hopefully catching fish. So. so after snowing for a couple days straight, Looks like the sun has come out, and maybe I can get out there and do a video for you guys. So. I am actually able to go out and fish. This morning I woke up and the sun was out. It's a beautiful day. We still got snow though, but not a lot. It seems to be melting quite a bit. So I think this is going to be a good day for fishing. Um, done a little light fishing here and there but not with my video camera and I've caught a few trout here actually I caught seven one day in just a matter of an hour so it's pretty good here I want to try out the new rod so here it is this is that beautiful rod and uh, we'll see how it does I haven't fished it yet um, I have a feeling it's gonna do really good with roll casting just because of that uh, double taper line um, it's just Really nice, I have a feeling. Plus, it's a it's a 10 foot rod, so it's gonna be able to cast a little better and get a little more distance. Um, but it feels really nice. I mean, just holding it, I'm I'm feeling the the weight of it, and it's just it's light. Um, it's not tip heavy at all. It seems to like it's gonna cast really well. So 
I'm excited about it. Thanks for watching and uh, again, click that subscribe button at the bottom and hope to see you soon.